Hey guys, this is Dave again, American Kettler. Well, I got my second circuit going here. This is the, the next step up. I'm using a source battery and a charge battery. And pretty easy. I just had to make a few minor modifications, add another diode, added a, a bulb there you can see blinking, and the other battery to the circuit. Pretty much the same circuit, just slightly modified. This is my uh, new source battery, and it's been running for about a half an hour now. It was at, let's see, when I started, is at 12.58. You can see now it's at 12.55 for half an hour. That's not too bad. And this is my charge battery, and let's see what it's running at. And we're at 12.53, which is pretty good. This is the battery I was using for my last experiment. And I had taken it down to about 12.4 volts. So it's charging back up. So it looks like this circuit is doing what it's supposed to be doing. Using the source voltage to run the fan. And back EMF to charge the uh, charge battery. Pretty neat. It's like the fan has a slight oscillation there. It's just sitting on a plastic cup there. And that's the camera making a jitter like that. And the bulb too. The bulb's actually flickering at a lot higher rate. And I think that's the camera doing that too. But, uh, it's working. I'm not sure if I mentioned in my last video, but you know this is a lot of fun. I really like this. I can't wait for my parts to come in. I'm still waiting for the magnet wire, a few other things, so I can start winding some coils. And I think I'm ready for the next phase. Well, here you go. Thanks again for everyone's help and comments. I appreciate it. This is my next obsession, the Bedini world of electronics. I'll keep you informed. Once again, thanks a lot. Dave out.